This is an NBC News special report. Here's Hoda Kotb. Good morning. Good to see you. You are coming on the air right now with breaking news. A massive global technical outage tied to CrowdStrike, which is a major cybersecurity provider, has knocked critical computer infrastructure offline all across the country and, in fact, all around the world. It's an issue with a software update. It's impacting lots and lots of Microsoft computer systems worldwide, from businesses to emergency services, 911, traffic lights, transit systems, and it's having a major impact on airlines as well. American, Delta, United, they're all keeping their flights grounded. You're looking at some live scenes systems worldwide from businesses to emergency services 911 traffic lights transit systems and it's having a major impact on airlines as well American Delta United they're all keeping their flights grounded you're looking at some live scenes from the airport it is chaos again 6 a.m. on the East Coast and this is the scene now they're having difficulty even printing any kind of boarding passes this of course is a developing situation the full scope of this problem remains to be seen. And Brian, as we get started right here in Studio 1A, we should point out computers at NBC News right I've here as we're as getting well. on the air. We're trying to do some workarounds here to get on the air. But this is something that's affecting people worldwide. Yeah, and other newsrooms, our partners over at Sky News having issues as well. I mean, this is impacting all different types of businesses. When you talk about airlines, you also talk about, uh, you know, uh, just 911 services, in some cases reporting outages as well. Uh, and you're even hearing of anecdotes of banks in other countries experiencing that. We don't yet have reporting of banks in the United States being impacted by this, but this appears to be not just the United States worldwide and across different types of industries. This definitely speaks to what I feel like is the fragility of the situation. Right. It's like a, this is not a cyber attack. This is a computer kind of snafu that happened. Yeah. And just to kind of walk you through exactly what's going yeah. on here. So this appears to be an issue between CrowdStrike and Microsoft. So CrowdStrike, for those that aren't familiar, is a cybersecurity firm that basically provides businesses with a way to foolproof their systems from being hacked. Now, apparently what happened was that CrowdStrike was working on some sort of update. Uh, we just heard from the CEO in the last few minutes describing this as not a security incident or cyber attacks. I'm going to okay. repeat that again. It doesn't appear to be a cyber attack at issue here. But the reason why CrowdStrike is so instrumental to not just businesses here in the United States, but around the world is because any sort of business that hires CrowdStrike to basically uh, foolproof their systems, well, they're going to be incorporating that into their computers. So if they get that, it's being, being plugged into Microsoft computers. If there's an issue with CrowdStrike, it takes down all of those Microsoft computers that are related to that. The company's saying Mac and Linux computers are not impacted, but Again, this well, is very interesting widespread. because I think what happened was a lot of people this was happening in Australia, Europe, while we were all sleeping, we woke up and we we're like, right. what's going on? But what people are finding is they're getting on their computers or at the bank or at the airline and they're seeing just a blue screen. Is that what's going on? Yeah, well, the term for this is called the blue screen of death. And I, I don't know if we have examples that we can show on the screen right now, but uh, we've, we've been seeing it even in our newsrooms this morning. So it's basically this blue screen that has this prompt that says, you know, we're, you're having issues and they're, they're basically trying wow. to figure out a workaround, but that essentially bricks your computer. You are unable to log in. Now, that's scary for any person that's just trying to log into their personal computer, although it's not clear if your personal computer has CrowdStrike, if it doesn't have that plug-in or have that cybersecurity layer, it, you likely won't be affected because of the nature of what we understand this issue to be. But for all these enterprise companies, which is translation for corporate customers that use this protection, well, well that's a major issue. If you can't log in, you can't print out the boarding passes to get people on their planes. You can't, uh, you know, as a bank teller, even get fired up to help open up someone's deposit account. This is a major right. issue. CrowdStrike says that they uh, have an issue. They, they identified the issue. They isolated it, and there's a fix that has been deployed. How long that fix takes to basically patch over all this, we don't know, as it seems like anecdotes of these issues and outages are still out there. And when you're 